the odds to become not just the most downloaded African-American male model, but also a two-time Golden, uh, Golden Gloves champion, excuse me. But the fame and success has not made him forget his roots. And now he's going the extra mile to give kids in his country a fighting chance. Our Tamsin Fidel has more. So today we're joined by Ingo at Nespresso, and of course it's always nice to see you. The last time we saw you though at the station, uh, you didn't have your shirt on, actually. <laughs> well, People might remember today, that. So you know, I'm gonna. We're gonna keep it. Uh, keep all my clothes on. That's perfect. Thank you very much. <laughs> Two-time heavyweight champion, as we can see by the golden gloves around Thank your you. neck. And of course, a huge model. You're downloaded so much online, I know that. And you're also doing so many different things, a lot of uh, charitable things. One in particular is a, a calendar you've just released. Yes. Talk to me a little bit about the calendar. This calendar is very dear to my heart because I'm using the proceeds from the calendar to provide kids back home in Nigeria with uh, protective equipment for boxing. I'm a friend of mine came home uh, from Nigeria he's a boxer as well and he was sparring with some of the younger fighters back home and um, he was telling me that some of the guys were used you know were sharing headgear and mouthpieces so I felt that I had to do something and I could do something a calendar would be a great way to draw awareness to the situation and raise funds we talked about it last time that we were together that it's, it's really important to you to give back in some way you got into boxing at a later age though right I did. 31 I years did. old yes extremely yeah. successful Go into uh, you your know, backstory I feel, a little bit. Um, I feel very blessed. I feel that my um, being from another country and uh, experiencing how hard life can be um, just fed my drive. So no matter how much the punches hurt or no matter what my opponent did, I just felt like um, I just had a whole country behind me and I couldn't and not let them down. You're still modeling. Yes, sir. What are you doing now? Actually, right now, we're in the editing phase of my documentary uh, titled, titled The Triumph of the Will, which uh, chronicles my journey from Nigeria to the U.S. and all my success here in the U.S. Just basically to show people that you can do anything, no matter uh, what it is, no matter how old you are. Because a lot of people say, oh, you know, once you hit your 30s, it's all downhill from there but I started boxing at 31 which is you know a time that most people retire, retire from, boxing. from boxing if you had one statement one idea one thing that you want to say to the kids in Nigeria even the kids here but no matter how hard things are do not lose your dream hold on to that dream and work work hard and it will come true something all of us need to hear actually yes. all right we're gonna have you back in the studio to do some boxing next time I promise you that all right all right Ingo thanks so much shirt, for joining shirt us or no shirt. Shirt. you could do no shirt it's okay, fine cool. I, th I don't think anybody Perfect. minded cool. I think Where can people like get the that, calendar actually. they can get the calendar on my website www.getingo.com we got it